Hello everyone, in this video we're going to look at the steps to bypass the TPM 2.0 secure boot, CPU and other system requirements if you want to install Windows 11 on a device that does not meet the minimum hardware requirements. However, here's a warning, installing Windows 11 on unsupported hardware is not recommended because it is not supported and you might not get updates and you may experience crashes and other problems. So to bypass the system requirements, we're going to need to download the media creation tool, that bad tool from the GitHub web page. But just to be clear, this is not the tool that Microsoft offers. Instead, it is an open source tool to download the Windows files from the Microsoft servers to create an ISO or USB bootable media. But the tool also now includes a script that you can use to modify the registry that allows you to launch the setup and skip the requirements to install Windows 11. And once you're on the page, you need to click the download zip button. And then you can save that to your computer. Then open the file, click the extract all button and click this extract button to begin the process. Just to make sure that you noticed, this particular virtual machine does not meet the minimum requirements. As we can see, it doesn't have TPM 2.0. And if we run the PC Health Check app, we're going to see that this PC currently does not meet the Windows 11 system requirements. Now open the contents of the folder. And here you're going to find different files. And the one that we're interested in is the one that reads the skip TPM check. Then you're going to right click on it and select the run as administrator option. Click more info and then click the run anyway button. And now we should be able to start the setup again, but this time the tool should skip the system requirements. As you can see, now we can continue with the setup process. But here's the thing, even though you can bypass the system requirements, you will be required to confirm that you understand that the computer does not meet the requirements, so Windows 11 will not be supported on that installation. Also, using this tool, it might be tricky, so you might have to run it multiple times in order to get it to work with the Windows installation media. And sometimes you're even going to have to run the script and restart the computer and then run the setup to make it work. Once you're ready to upgrade to Windows 11, click the set button. And then you just need to click the install button. I don't need to install Windows 11 on this computer, so I'm just going to cancel this installation. But that's exactly what you need to do to bypass the TPM 2.0, secure boot, CPU, and other system requirements to install Windows 11. Remember to like the video, share it, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet, and I just hope this video was informative for you, and I would like to thank you for viewing.